Hey, 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 welcome back to Seasonal Dead Man Mode, guys. This is episode two. Um, sorry about last episode. Last episode, I was such a fail. Started off so badly. It was such a pain. I really wanted to do well this time around, but I guess it came at a bad time for me because the tournament just ended and I needed a break. Oh, so bad. Um, I, it's, bad, it's a shame as well because Seasonal is what I was most excited for, but then I, had, I tried really hard in Dead Man Mode. This tournament it kind of spoiled me for me uh, for Seasonals. So next, hopefully next Seasonals I'll be a bit more prepared. If there's a tournament beforehand in a minute, I don't think I'll go as hard as I did last time. Um, but anyway, today's episode, well, seems as we died and I'm like years behind. It's now been two days since uh, I think Seasonals have been released. So it is now Monday. And it's actually 4 p.m., so it's been a long time. So it has been about two days since I was last on. Um, so sorry, I had a short episode yesterday, last time around. Last episode was only about two hours into um, Seasonals when it's finished. I'm massively behind. Apparently, it's people with really high levels. There's level 80 combats, people walking around, people with DDSs, dragon uh, skimmers, maybe even ancients. I'm not quite sure. Um, so it's a bit worrying because people have made so much progress. I'm assuming because there's so many more people playing and there's so many more worlds even though it's not 10 times experience five times experience is enough to make that much progress when there's that many people around um so i'm just gonna crack on start this episode off with a bit of silk i'm not gonna go as hard this week because i've got lots of things coming up i think tomorrow i've got a test at uni the day after that i've got a test at uni so i've got two tests coming up which i need to do and focus on so i'm about to play too much oh, you see after me already screw off um so i'm not gonna make as much progress as i'd like and he's died um and then i think on saturday i'm i'm gone for like over 24 hours because I've got to go to a family stag do which is a shame because I'm going to be really far behind on this uh, seasonals plus I'm not going to go as hard as I did last week because I was really unsocial last week and I need to you know, be a bit more social again so I'm not going to make serious progress yet but it's three months of seasonals is so I could go hard in summer I've got a month off during Easter well Easter's past now but uh, I think I finished term at like you know halfway through April so I'll have like a whole month off and I'll be able to go really hard then and I do plan on going quite hard just not yet so hope you guys enjoy this uh, uh, episode and we'll begin by trying to make some cash. So yeah, I thieved a couple of more uh, Venture Falls of Silk, got myself a little bit of cash, brought myself a star fa fire, what What am I saying? Star for fire and bought off this lovely guy, Steve. Thank you very much, man. And I am now just quickly doing a few casts to get my defense up and it's now level 10 and my HP up a little bit whilst getting magic up, which magic up's gone up like 10 levels already. So I'll be here using a few runes and then I shall be probably doing a few quests because I need to catch up with everyone else, literally. So that's the plan at the moment. There we go, just finished off my um, few kills I was going to do here. I'm not going to grab those. Got myself 34 magic in the meantime and also got myself 19 defense with 23 HP. Which ain't too bad at all to be honest. I'm actually doing quite well for myself with just 250 runes I, I used I think. For 250 casts, I don't know. Um, but the plan is now to start Grand Tree to do that and to get my agility up. Basically the same as Deadman tournaments but now it's five times experience so things take a lot longer um, and otherwise I also got 33 thieving by the way when I um, was stealing those silks so let's go and uh, get a bit of sweat and do a bit of exercise shall we there we go 25 agility coming in guys uh, didn't take too long obviously a lot longer than it did take in uh, tournament worlds I can now start oh I unlocked a lot of things I didn't expect I can now start Grand Tree which I will do very momentarily and I'll probably do Tree Known Village as well alongside that so I can lock the tree teleportation system, plus I'll get a few attack levels which would be nice. Um, so yes, the plan at the moment. Let's go do those damn quests which I did literally a week ago. Fun, fun, fun. And that is Grand Tree started. Got my six uh, logs. Let's go start Tree Known Village. And that is Tree Known Village started. And a damn cutscene. No, not really. Get kicked out of this area. So that's Tree Known Village started now. I'm going to crack on with it. Um, literally it's a deja vu. Yay! That is the Dreamland Village quest done. I actually starting to love this quest now, the amount of times I've been doing it recently. Got the Amulet of Protection and I've got myself 28 attack, which hasn't really changed my combat levels. I think they've gone up maybe... No, they haven't changed at all. Um, so yeah, that's that done. I'm going to do Grand Tree now. That is Steve dancing his uh, arse off. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go do Grand Tree. Not right now, but later on. And then hopefully progress will start being made in this account finally again. And we'll have a bit of fun. Also thought I'd let you guys know, I've set up my uh, clan chat so anyone could join now, before it was set to friends only, my bad. Um, so anyone could join, if you guys want to chat to me there, because normally I'm a private off, usually. Um, so I don't, just because I just want to focus on the game most of the time. So if you guys want to chat to me or want to, you know, talk to me for a little bit, definitely join here. I might be around and I might respond, obviously it depends on how much I see of your messages. Um, but yeah, it'd be definitely the best way if you want to talk to me in game. So yeah, join Black Griffin. 
Well, well, well. It's been a while since I recorded any clips of the series. Actually, two weeks today. <laughs> it's been a very long time. Today is Monday the 11th of April, so it kind of shows you guys where I am and things. Um, I'm a noob. Everyone else is like elite PKers at the moment with all like max gear. So I am miles behind, but you know what? I thought I'd still keep going just for a bit of laugh, you know, see where I can make it this far behind. Because you never know. Um, I think the mode came out 16 days ago, so that's how long it's been out, and I am still a proper noob. All I've done is two quests, practically. Uh, Grand Tree I'm currently working on, which we're going to carry on and hopefully finish very, very soon. To see momentarily, if I don't die from a level 120 or something stupid. If you're wondering why I haven't recorded in such a long time, it's because I had quite a busy two weeks and I was a little bit lazy. Um, I've done all the things I said I was doing last episode, uh, earlier on this episode, which was I had a stag, I had two tests to do, and then I had the wedding. So, <clears throat> really, I was really busy and, well, as I said, lazy. So, But we're back on it, you know, I'm going to focus on this for a little while. Hopefully things go well. Hopefully we can have a better laugh. Uh, seeing as I was in the area anyway, I thought I'd do Fire Arena because it's quick as hell. And I got myself a load of experience I didn't expect to get. Well, I did expect the attack, but not the uh, thieving. Ooh, not bad. Um, 1k coins as well. Sweet. That's just like <laughs> heaven for a new star. <laughs> right, so yeah, I got 35 attack, which is pretty juicy. Now 30 combat. I think I was 27 before. Maybe got the combat levels through Mage. I don't know. So I did get to about two magic levels in time and the HP level. Anyway, let's finish that damn Grand Tree quest, which is a pain in my backside. Okay, not quite the Grand Tree, but I thought it was a quick, easy quest to do while I'm here. Plus, it can be really useful getting eight laws from this quest. If I went sort of partying, come on, we've got work to do. It's tiller mode, not party man mode. <laughs> as I was saying, those eight laws will be incredibly useful for me. I'm going to put as many of those into my deposit box as possible. Now I'm actually going to do the Grand Tree, but that is... I've got myself 16 uh, wood cutting as well, but those eight laws, oh, it's going to be so useful. Um, This is worrying, son. There's literally no one in the bank. Actually, think about it, I've not seen well, pretty much no one this whole damn time playing this morning. Worrying times. <laughs> and that is that quest done. Grand Tree completed. Got some agility levels. I'm assuming I should hit 30 at least. Yes, I have. So I'm going to go do some training at Varrock now um, until I decide what to do next. Plus, a few more agility levels won't be, um, you know... I kind of want it, <laughs> so I can have better on NG. Let's have a look. I've got 41 attacks. I can now use a rune skimmer. I've got 40 um, magic, which is quite nice. And that rune skimmer, I, I don't have a rune skimmer, nor am I going to have one anytime soon, because I don't have to get one. Although it should be relatively cheap now, seeing as it's been out for 16 days and everyone's using rune, uh, dragon skims or whips. So let's hope they're quite cheap. I might be able to purchase one myself soon ish. Anyway, let's go to Varrock and um, do some agility while I think about what to do next. Just hit 35 agility. Thought I'd update you guys. I'm going to do another five levels before I change what I am doing, so 40 agility incoming. I'm terrible at this game. I was running along doing agility and I looked at my levels. Oh wait, I'm 40 already. <laughs> my bad. It's not as great as 10 times experience, which is when I lasted this in uh, 20 worlds. But look at those levels just spamming in. Not even on filtered chat. Whoop! Anyway, that is 40 agility. My plan's next is to actually do something a bit different, something like I've never done before. Because it's going to be expensive to get my level by prayer to 43, so I could take myself around the game a bit more. I thought I'd do the other method I could train prayer rather than buying bones, which is re relatively cheap, which is to do, um, you know, necromancy, which you summon, you know, the heads of creatures and kill them and then you get experience. So that's my aim right now. I'm going to, because I don't have much to risk, this is all pretty much all I'm risking right now. That's all the stuff I've got. There's nothing in my bank at all. So I might as well just go for it, try to get to 60% and unlock the necromancy spell book, get that out of the way while I'm a noob, and see how it goes. I've never done um, RKS. Uh, rep before, so this will be a first for me. Wish me luck. Hmm, do I trust him? I'm gonna have to, aren't I? Serious. What a douchebag. Absolute douchebag. Rip. This looks awful. God damn it. What did I actually lose anyway? Uh, pff, three mage levels and two defense levels, really. And much else? Probably not really. No, that's about it, really. Yeah, back I go, I guess. I just got some of my stuff back. They're still downstairs uh, grabbing books. So, trying to wear off their skull. So, I'll probably just hop worlds right about now. I don't want to get PK'd, even though my bank's empty. <laughs> oh, I had a nice chat with the uh, PKers. <laughs> no hard feelings. This should be the last book. Yes, hurrah, I've hit 20%. So, now I can move on to do dark, seek dark knowledge. This wasn't too bad, it took me about an hour because I got PK'd, probably would have taken me about 45, maybe 50 minutes usually. Hopefully it should take about me about the same time to actually get to 60, fingers crossed. 
But half an hour later, I'm still at 21% uh, RKS favour, but I have got 11 manus uh, dark manuscripts, so hopefully if I calculate it right, it should get me to 60%. What? This now should be it, please. Yes, 60% favour, I can now use the spell book, get out of this crap of a place. My butt's sore, my butt's numb, my butt's all kind of things right now. But I'm out of here! Uh, the plans now, I guess, is probably to do some quests. I'm probably going to do Restless Ghost, and then I'll probably move on to do Merlin's Crystal, and then maybe Holy Grail. So I get my, I think, you prayer goes up to level 37, maybe? Or something when you do those quests. That'll give me a nice little foundation to start on with, and then uh, from there, I'll probably think about maybe carry on prayer training, or maybe do some more quests. We shall see how it goes. Yippee! The spirit is gone! That is, Restless Ghost done and out of the way with. I mean, I should get some prayer levels. levels. Yes, 10 prayer. Sweet! Which is quite nice, not that I'll be using this anytime soon. Also started doing, uh, what's that quest called? <laughs> Rune Mysteries, that's the one. Um, I'm not going to finish it now because I can't be bothered. Uh, might as well, I guess. Let, let's just finish Rune Mysteries. Might as well do it as I started it while I was doing Restless Ghost. Anyway, so let's go. That is Rune Mysteries completed without any hassle whatsoever. It's really nice, finally. Um, this is going to now allow me to do Priest in Peril, I feel. Yep, yeah, that's the one and my Impurescence for that quest, which is quite nice to do whenever I fancy. Um, I want to do Merlin's Crystal then Holy Grail, but I kind of want to get 45 magic before that, just in case, just so I can teleport to Cam Camelot and make the those quests a lot easier to do. I'm tempted, so I might make a bit of cash first quickly to get my magic up. We shall see. Or I might just walk. Yeah, I might just walk. I got the tree spirits on that, so I could just walk, can't I? There is 40 thieving coming in guys, it was 34 when I came here. The reason I'm here is because I'm just quickly grabbing myself some silk and to sell to get some cash to buy some runes to actually kill the geezer in the quest. Um, no one's actually selling these things in any world I don't think. So I've just got to bank the silk and sell them myself after waiting 15 minutes. The grind and the trouble of starting late. But now, seriously, yeah, um, I should have enough cash now. Just thought I'd show you guys 40 thieving. Back on the damn thieving grind. So it's like the third account doing this crap. Ugh. I'm going to end the video here, guys. I made myself almost 10k from the silks. I got myself, which is pretty nice. Could buy myself some spells so I could do the Merlin Crystal Quest. Quest, Quest, Crystal. That's Spoonerism, though. And, well, yeah, crack around the quests next episode. This episode was basically half a day's work because there are other half day I was busy doing other stuff today. So, I've got quite a lot of quests done, though, still. Well, I'm at 12 quest points now, which is quite nice. Got a lot of those out of the way. Also, got my. Archaeus uh, rep to 60%, which is really, really nice to do. It's out of the way with us, so I can now train prayer quite easily and cheaply. Um, so yeah, next episode, just going to be a lot of quests, probably queer, prayer, queer, prayer, I can't speak today. Prayer training and some more quests to get done. Hope you guys are happy this series is back. I'm a million times behind everyone else, but hopefully it'll be nice to see someone, you know, building their account 16 days after it started. And who knows, I might just do some crazy bit of PK, at, you know, early levels just because I'm not risking much. We shall see how it goes. I might surprise you next time with a bit of a shock PK. <laughs> if there's any low levels around that I could kill. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I shall catch you guys tomorrow with more quests. Yippee!